Hold up. Have you ever stopped to wonder why U.S. manufacturing is facing a staggering 600,000 worker shortage right now? Today, that's 600,000 workers, unfilled manufacturing jobs. Despite needing as many as 3.8 million new hires by 2023, studies warn that this shortfall could grow to 1.9 million jobs unfulfilled if we don't act. I'm Zach from 4.0 Solutions and our track record speaks for itself. We'd have over 10,000 students sign up for our free IIoT mini course at IIoT University. And we have over a thousand paid students. We build digital fluency for everyone from beginners to the most advanced experts and solutions architects in the world. Today, I promise you'll walk away with actionable strategies to tackle America's staggering 600,000 worker shortage in manufacturing by implementing a digital strategy. Whether you are a manufacturer or you want to work for one, we're gonna show you how to turn this challenge into a growth opportunity. Here's what we'll cover in this video. First, we'll dissect the root causes behind the labor shortage and why traditional methods aren't cutting it. Then, we'll dive into the core elements of digital transformation, highlighting our proven unified namespace approach, and we'll share some key insights from our Employee of the Future workshop. Finally, I'll share practical steps you can implement immediately to bridge the skills gap and boost your competitive edge. Let's get started. Section one, understanding the labor shortage. The labor shortage in manufacturing is driven by several factors. First, we're facing an aging workforce. Many experienced employees are retiring, and there aren't enough young professionals with the right skills stepping in. This isn't just about numbers, it's about a critical loss of expertise on the plant floor. Some people call it the brain drain. Why is that? Let's face it. Manufacturing isn't as sexy as other consumer technology industries. Even when Gen Z talent comes to the shop floor, not enough stays. A study from McKinsey showed that in manufacturing, 48% of Gen Z workers say they intended to leave within the next three to six months. Manufacturers, you are actively deterring the next generation of workforce and your outdated hiring practices and a lack of a digital strategy are to blame. That's right, if you are a manufacturer, you are to blame. Secondly, the rapid growth of manufacturing means that the demand for skills outpaced the current level of talent pool. While companies must hire millions of new workers, the competition for talent extends far beyond manufacturing. Industries like healthcare and tech are pulling at the same skilled labor, leaving manufacturing scrambling to fill roles. And finally, traditional training methods haven't kept up with the industry's pace of change. The skills required today, digital fluency, automation, data analytics, are vastly different from those needed even a decade ago. Section two, projected shortfall and a wake up call. A study by the Manufacturing Institute in Deloitte projects that by 2033, 1.9 million manufacturing jobs could go unfilled. That is a wake up call for our sector. And it isn't just a challenge for HR departments. It's a strategic threat to productivity, innovation, and our competitive edge in a global market. Imagine a future where the shortage isn't just a temporary hiccup, but a chronic bottleneck holding back our country's growth, delaying innovation, and forcing companies to rely on temporary or costly outsourcing solutions. Or worse, you risk going out of business or getting purchased by your competitors if you're not able to attract the digital talent of the future. The numbers are alarming and we need to act now. Section three, the digital transformation opportunity. Now here's where the conversation gets interesting. While the labor shortage presents a huge challenge, it offers an opportunity for transformation. Digital transformation in manufacturing isn't just about adopting new tech, it's about reinventing how the business operates. At 4.0 Solutions, we view digital transformation as a strategy, not a project. It's an ongoing journey towards a smarter and more agile operation, where data is the primary commodity for making decisions. Key concepts from our Digital Factory Mastermind program shows that successful digital transformation hinges on these steps. Understanding your current digital maturity, inventorying every bit of intelligence you already have, and then connecting it all to a unified system. In our world, that means creating a unified namespace, a centralized platform where every sensor, machine, and system feeds into one source of truth. It contains both the structure and the events of your business. What does that mean? It's not your historical data, it's the current state and all the events that happen in your business that pass through this unified namespace. So every application is aware of the most current value and every event that happens. This is crucial for AI. 
Section four, insights from the Employee of the Future Workshop. Let's talk about the workforce itself. The Employee of the Future Workshop has taught us that tomorrow's manufacturing employees are expected to be multi-skilled, digitally savvy, and continuously learning. This is the generation of people that were born with an iPad in their hands. They need to have access to real-time data, engage with hands-on training, and be empowered to innovate on the fly. We're not just waiting for someone to fill a position, we're actively building an ecosystem. That means investing in reskilling and upskilling programs that are agile and responsive, provide digital apprenticeships, and foster a culture where every employee is a stakeholder in innovation. Too many times we hear from engineers who want to invest in industry for training and learn how to digitally transform, yet those requests fall on dead ears in upper management. This highlights the issue with the industry. This digital first approach not only bridges the skills gap, but also makes manufacturing workplaces more attractive to the next generation. It's not just an option, it's a requirement. Section five, the keys to digital transformation in manufacturing. Digital transformation is more than just about technology. It's about strategy. Here are some key concepts that are essential for success in Industry 4.0. Number one, know what your digital strategy is. Every initiative should be part of a larger digital vision. Understand where you are, define where you want to be, and then map out clear steps to get there. This is what we do as part of our digital transformation maturity assessment process. Next tip, treat every data point as a node in your ecosystem. Don't build isolated solutions. Create a scalable technology stack like a unified namespace that connects every system, sensor, and application in one place. Beware of creating a solution stack, one that could lead to vendor lock-in. This approach not only streamlines operations, it provides all of the complete contextual data your AI systems need to drive smarter decisions. If you missed the last video, that's what we talked about in why your AI projects are failing. Embrace an agile and continuous improvement mindset. Digital transformation isn't a one and done project. It's an evolving process. That's why it's called a journey. Embrace a culture where everyone is constantly learning, experimenting, and adapting. Also, be aware. In the end, 80% of your tangible results will often come in the last 20% of the development process. So make sure you account for this. Section six, actionable steps for manufacturers. So what can you do today? First, start by evaluating your current operations. Assess your digital maturity, highlight any skills gaps, and identify the pain points in your existing processes and workflows. Inventory every data source and every system you have. Next, invest in your workforce. Industry 4.0 starts with education. Launch a reskilling initiative to provide on-the-job training focused on building digital fluency. Empower your employees to become innovators. Then, build the technology backbone of your future. Create a unified namespace. This will centralize all of your data, eliminating data silos, and provide the full real-time context necessary for AI and advanced analytics to work their magic. It's the foundation that will let your company adapt rapidly and scale efficiently. Look, here's the bottom line. U.S. manufacturing labor shortage isn't just a statistic. It's a call to action to reimagine how we work. This video is especially important to us because our core mission is to save and create middle-class jobs in the United States by helping manufacturers become data-driven and do more with less. By having a clear digital strategy, the right architecture, and focusing on empowering the employee of the future, we can not only overcome these challenges, but turn them into a competitive advantage. Drop your thoughts in the comments below. What's the biggest barrier you face in bridging the skills gap? And don't forget to subscribe for more deep dives into Industry 4.0 and digital transformation strategies. Together, let's build a future where American manufacturing workforce is agile, innovative, and ready to meet tomorrow's challenges. Thanks for watching.